So today I'll be starting a new series called the React Native Animation Series. This is the first video in that series. In this video, I'll show you how to create this scrollable header, which is there in the Twitter app. So in the app, when the user scrolls up, the profile picture and the header reduce in size. Then the picture gets hidden behind the header. And when the text comes up to the header, it starts appearing in the header in white color. So let's begin. So we'll start with an empty React Native project. We start by creating a few constants first. The first one is going to be called header max height. Give it a max height of 120. Header minimum height of 70. A profile image max height of 80. And a profile image min height of 40. These values will be useful to us when we're trying to animate the image and the header. Now let's come to the view here. Let's get rid of the view. Create a new empty view. I'll add all the styles in line so that they're easy to understand. So we start by giving a flex of one. Next, we want to have a header here. So we'll absolutely position the header on the top here. So let's create another view and let's give it some styles. First one is going to be position which is going to be absolute. Then we'll say top zero, left zero and right of zero. Give it a background color of light blue. Let's call it light sky blue. And let's give it a height of header max height. We save that, we get the header in front of us. Next, let's import a scroll view into our app. So here at the top, let's say scroll view. And let's put the scroll view below the header. Give it a flex of one. And inside this scroll view, we'll put another view which will have our profile picture. So for that, let's import an image over here as well. Inside the view, let's put in the image. And you can use any image that you want. I'll use one from my assets folder. So if you save that, we're getting a very big image, but we want a small rounded image. So let's put this image into another view. And let's give some styles to this view. So the height of the image we want is the profile image max height that we had set. And the width also should be profile image max height since we want it to be rounded. Give it a border radius of half of the profile image max height. A border color of white and a border width of three. Let's also set overflow equal to hidden so that the image is nicely inside the circle and hidden should be in quotes. Now we need to make the image expand into that view. So what we'll say is style is equal to flex of one and let's set the width and height to null. This trick will make sure that the image fits in correctly. And there we can see we've got our image. So let's first get the image to the right place where we want it to be. For that, what we'll do is we'll give this view a margin top, which will be equal to the height of the header minus half the height of the image so that it fits in perfectly in the middle over here. So we'll say header max height minus profile max height divided by two. Put this into brackets here. And if we save that, we can see that the image is coming in perfectly. We'll also put in a margin left over here of 10. And let's also just put in the text below it. So let's put in another view here and put in a text inside that, which has my name in it. And we'll just add some styles to the text. Give it a font weight of bold, font size of 26, and a padding left of 10 as well. So now that we have the layout ready, in the next video, I'll show you how to animate this.